Uh, my next guest uh, deals with anger, okay? Uh, I myself enjoy it. Uh, some say he screams so that uh, he feels better about himself. Some also say that maybe he needs to take a break from the frustration station and check into the Chill the Fuck Out Hotel. Please welcome the great Bill Burr. Let him hear it. Uh, have, you, have you and your wife ever swung with another famous couple? Uh, duh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, Bill, I would love to answer a question uh, without... Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, look, I think, again, Robin, and, and Robin takes the charge. Again, 42 years, you got to keep it fresh. And uh, she once told me, she was like, I'm tired of you having to have people tell you to go fuck yourself, so I'm going to wear a mask of your face so you can fuck me and feel what it feels like. We'll be right back. No, we're going to keep it right here. We got no more commercials built. But no, I, I don't know. Well, look, Aunt, riddle me this. So you've been married. I was picturing like that's what you say after you orgasm. You know? We'll be right back. <laughs> You go get a warm washcloth and you just throw it at her. <laughs> you have a giant horse cock, don't you, Phil? You just look like you do. This, uh, all you bald, fucking mustachioed Dennis Franz looking guys. You guys are always in the co well, coming in the steam room with some fucking depression era meat hammer. <laughs> I'll take that coming as a in like it looks like it's hanging from a bell. <laughs> Tampon commercials are harder than you think. Oh, I would pay top dollar to see you as the spokesperson for Tampax. It's not a, it's not an easy thing to to break down. You know, I'm a father. You're a father. At some point, it's, it's curable though. Periods? Yeah. How so? If you just lose enough weight as a woman. <laughs> Don't you tense up now? It's Tuesday. <laughs> Bill, where are you from? Massachusetts. Right, and that's uh, the other side of the country. What's happening yeah, it's over... It's one of the, the ones that started it all. Started what? The genocide of Native Americans. We did it first. That was going to be my next that's question. The, when did the genocide the of began. Native Americans start? That's why, like, the flag had the, the circle. I remember. Because we were encircling the Native Americans, you know? But the ones who survived, they got those casinos. <laughs> <laughs> what? They didn't? You know they fucking did. They did, yeah. When's the last time you Read went to a, a reservation and tried to help somebody out? Read a book, pussy. <laughs> but I want to know, you know, anger comes from, you know, deep down. And, and what, what is it about people that pisses you the fuck off, you know? Because I'll go into a Rite Aid and somebody will be like, where are the paper towels? And I'll be this close to taking out a little Swiss Army knife and just fucking jabbing it. That's why I've always been a fan of your show. Appreciate it. Because as much as like you're helping people, well, I can just see you snapping a hooker's neck in Reno. In Reno, just, try you, Sacramento. Yeah. You look like a Shh. You look like a corrupt cop. <laughs> <laughs> like you have a taped up pistol in your ankle. And I think your wife is afraid of you. Don't make like me if laugh. the hermaphrodites didn't bring it that week and you didn't get the ratings you wanted. Like, I just see her in a panic making a Reuben before you can get home to try to calm you. Don't make me laugh, Bill. My mustache will fall off. All right. Do you have a karaoke room in your giant house? Yeah. A little stage? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I love to perform. I'm addicted. I like uh, George Jones. I'm George a, Jones. He's a big George what Jones. What is he? Is that a country artist? Yeah. What is he? He has the saddest songs. Someone's on the freeway. No, he's oh. in a big empty house, and she left and took his kid. Like shit, like that. Yeah, that's real. Yeah. No, I mean it's like. Well, country it, but, music. But it's like so sad. That it's not. But you it find just, yourself it tapping your toe. It makes you laugh. Toe. No, you start yeah. laughing. It's just so fucking. Well, every right up. 
Yeah. Come on in. Yeah. If you'd like to see the something of a man. Yeah, the like sun's that. coming out. No, my dog's in the back. There's ketchup on my pants again. <laughs> I'm going to the back to get another right, pair. Take me. Take, to, take me, me to, to Siberia. Siberia. <laughs> the coldest weather of the winter time. When's it and it would feel, feel just like, like spring, spring in, in California, California if I knew, if I knew, knew you were mine. mine. It's a love song. Yeah. My neighbor tried to fuck me. <laughs> I was still wearing my boots. <laughs> Here comes the postmates. <laughs> Why do I have a glass front door? <laughs> Maybe he will join us. You know, I wrote down here, you talked a lot about Nazis. Um, no, well, let me finish. I, I not join the group, you know who but made the stop Nazis? Them. Who made the Nazis? Who made the Nazis? Yeah. Uh, you know, God. Hugo Ba. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> No, Hugo Boss outfitted the Nazis. That's what, that's what I meant. Let me finish. And they, and they crushed it. Oh, Hugo Boss. Uh, gorgeous. Gorgeous. Man, it's as tough ugly to... as the work that was done in them, the clothes were gorgeous. Why do you think, why do you think Nazis get such a bad rap? They don't like fashion? What's that? Why do you think, I'll say it again, why do you think Nazis get such a bad rap? Because it was on video. That's why, no, because you can't deny it. You can't. You can't just pretend it didn't happen and not put it in the history books. They filmed the shit because right. they thought they were going to win. Okay, I got it. All right. You know who else thought they were going to win? The Catholic Church. And they wanted them to win because they were going to take out a whole religion. That was good for their business. And then all of a sudden they fucking lost. And then they had to give back the gold and shit to the families. Like, oh, sorry about that. Oh, is that us? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you never read about that? Yeah, hey, I'm going to... No, they I'm, found fucking dead Jewish people's belongings and all of, the, all of the good shit. Not the clothes. They didn't give a fuck about that. But the, the, the shit that was worth money, they found it in the Vatican. Some of it, not all of it. You gonna see the new Indiana Jones? <laughs>